Okay, our next widget that we're going to look at is the widget that is an interactive image. This can be really useful in a lot of learning areas, so obviously you're going to use it for all your maps, but also consider any scientific diagrams, any diagrams where you are highlighting different parts of an image of some sort, such as um, images from movies and different things like that that you're going to be investigating deeply, because it means that you can really highlight certain aspects of that image rather than just having all of the information straight away. So once you've put your widget on your page, all you need to do is to drag an image over the top. All right. Once we let go, then what we have is some preset image um, bits that we can write into. So you can add some more in. So all we're doing is double tapping. And once I've double tapped, I can then move where it goes. So I can move the element or I can move where it is pinned to as well. So I can move my picture down. So, oh my, what big teeth you have. Okay. Now, if I want to add in some extras, so at the moment there's only two in there, I can just go plus, and what I now have, as you can see over here, is I have my placeholders, and again, I can move those wherever I wish to and so on. I can change my picture down, so I can see how much of the picture that I want to have visible versus how much of the text that I want to have visible. So every element within it is completely customizable. So always think, how can you get this to work the best way possible? So simple way, just drop your picture in and then start to edit each of the aspects of it. Again, you can go to layout and I can take off my title and I can take off my background if I just want to have my image as a preset. Now in this part here on my image, what I can do is I could have my preset part of my image there and I can go set the view and that means that's the extent that I will see or if I want to I could move it so I set the view here and so that's what you will see in the movie in the when you interact with the image so there's different parts that you will be able to see of it okay